keep wanting craze. I am going to show you guys my crazy scenario for today. I went ahead and just used up all of the coupons on one account, so that's a total of four of them. Um, if you guys don't already know, I am talking about Walgreens. We have a bunch of coupons. We're looking at three off of 15, $5 off of 12, five off of 15, and a five off of 20. Those are the ones that I used today. I did do four transactions, and I have them set up a different way today. Um, so I'm continuing to make adjustments, just depending on what deal it is. Um, so it makes sense to you guys, you know, I know a lot of people were like, so what deal do I do first? So I'm going to show you guys exactly what I did to give you guys again, ideas on what you guys can do again, very important. I buy things that I need for my household. So if these products are not something that you guys need, please, please, please do edit it as like you need to make sure you guys are buying products that actually are gonna be beneficial to you. Also, I did in one of these transactions where I will let you guys know, of course, use one of these coupons. So these are the spent, I'm sorry, boosters. It's a spend 20, get 5,000 points back. So I combined that in my last scenario where I will go over that with you guys. But let me go ahead and just talk to you guys about the first one. So right over here, Super simple transaction. We're talking about the Coke products. So they are on sale. Let me grab this so I can show you guys. So we buy three Coke products. So they are the 12 cans on these ones. So they're buy two, you get one for free. And each one of them is $6.19. So that brings us to our total right here of $12.38. And I went ahead and used this coupon first, the five off of 12. And in this scenario, I know I have been mentioning to you guys to use the three off of 15. I knew that three off of 15 wouldn't apply at all because my total didn't reach $15. So I was safe to go ahead and do this one first. Although I could have switched them around, it's no big deal. I paid a total out of pocket of $7.38. For my scenarios, I try to not use points on many of them if I'm gonna show you guys what I did, just so it makes more sense. But I totally could have used $5 in points and just paid $2.38 out of pocket plus tax. But like I mentioned, $7.38 out of pocket and each one of them comes down to $2.46, which that is a killer deal on each one of those um, 12 packs. My household does drink Coke products, so it was a really good deal for me to get on this um, coupon. Moving it over to our Tide. This is one of the deals I did share with you guys in an earlier video. So we are going to use digitals and paper coupons because we do know that the Tide has a limit of one, which is a $2 off of one coupon. So in this transaction, this is my second transaction, I bought three of the Tide, so two of the deter liquid detergents and one of the pods. And as we know, Tide is buy three and get a $5 register reward. And I had to add a filler for this one because I needed it to be a total of at least $15. So as you guys can see, the each one of the Tide, no matter which one it is, pods or the liquid detergent, is $4.99 and my candy was 50 cents. So my total comes up to $15.47. That $3 off of 15 coupon applies and then the three manufacturer coupon for the Tide apply, total of $6 bringing our out-of-pocket to $6.47. Again, on this one, I could have used $5 in points, paid $1.47 out-of-pocket, and then still received this $5 register reward. So for me, it was $6.47, and then I received the $5 register reward, making all these products here $1.47. So I'm gonna go ahead and go over like all of my out-of-pockets and the points I received back at the end to show you guys what all of these transactions ended up looking like. Here, we're looking at the scope and the deodorant. I also did share this deal with you guys. So we know that the scope, the crest, they are the large ones. I've gotten a lot of questions on this. It's the large one liter or the 33.8 fluid ounces. 
They are $4.79 a piece, and then the Mitchum, they are on sale this week, $2.99, but when you buy two, you get 3,000 points back. So if we take a look at this, so we're buying three scope on the buy two, get one, buy two Mitchum, buy two, get 3,000 points back, and there's the layout as far as how much each one of them is. So our total comes up to $15.56. Perfect, we don't need to add our filler item because it reaches $15 in the threshold. The seven off of three digital coupon will apply to the three mouthwashes. I've used this coupon in a couple of my scenarios, so you may have used it already. On this account, I still did have it active. Then we have a $1 off of one digital coupon for the Mitchum. And then lastly, on this account, I did have that $5 off of 15 that we randomly got starting last week, effective today. It was a very first day it started. So out of pocket, just $2.56, a low one on this. Again, I could have used points, $2 in points, paid 56 cents out of pocket. I'm just keeping it simple, paying $2.56, receiving 3,000 points back for our Mitchum that was right up here. Okay, so now I'm moving into, this is probably, yeah, it is the largest transaction that I had. Although it is quite simple as well, I did share this. Actually, this is the only deal that I did not share with you guys because I have not shared any spend 20 get $5 off yet. So let me move this a little bit. So there we go. It's that last one with the Pantene. So, okay, for anyone that does have the spend 20 get 5,000, I'm sorry, spend 20 and get $5 off, here is one scenario that you can do. So we are buying three Pantene. If you guys know, they are three for 12 right now. The gain is $4.99. And then the Crest, I have talked about this one as well. They are $3.59. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys which Crest it is because you wanna make sure you're getting the smaller one. The other one, it's a little bit larger. It's like $4 and something. Okay, so let's take a look at this. There's a little bit of a glare, hopefully. There it goes. So it's the three ounces. Sorry, I was gonna say 3.0. I don't need to add that. But anyways, make sure it's this one. It's $3.59. Also on the buy two, get one. And we wanna pick up three of them like I have here. So going back into the scenario here, we're buying the three Pantines, they're three for 12, one of the gains, and then buy three Crest, the buy two, get one. So our total on this one comes up to $24.17, well over the threshold that we need to meet for the $20. Our five off of three is going to be on the Pantene, that first one I show there, then the two off of one for the gain, the five off of three on the Crest products, and then the five off of 20 is the very last coupon that we had um, just from Walgreens. So bringing our total down to $7.17. This is the only scenario that I personally could not use points on because like I mentioned, I did use a spend booster. So this guy right here, I was able to use it on this transaction, so I was not able to use points because anytime, anytime you use points on this one specifically, you won't get points back. So $7.17 out of pocket, and then I received 50, I'm sorry, I received 5,000 points back equivalent to $5. So now you're like, you still kind of spend a lot of money. Let me go ahead and go over everything that I just spent. So on the first one there, which is the Coke products, I spent $7.38. Tide, I spent $6.47. The Crest, $2.56. And then the last one, I did spend $7.17. But I also received $5.00 5 in points on that last transaction. Three dollars in points in the Mitchum, so that's a total of I'm missing one. Oh, and then the register reward from the Tide also five dollars. So my total out of pocket, if I add everything up, 
It's this puppy right here, $18.16. Still, if you think about it, $18 for all of these things, it's still a really good deal. Of course, we would never pay that much for all of these things, but for any average person, I would definitely do that. Anyways, we're not average. Rewards, it's a total of 13. So like I said, the $5 register reward, 5,000 points back, and then 3,000 points back. So if we subtract our out-of-pocket minus the rewards, it's a total of $5.66. So yes, all of this stuff here, you basically, or I guess I did if you want to do the transaction, you can also pay $5.66 for everything. So breaking it down a little further, if you like knowing like how much did you pay per item, a total of 31 cents. So you're telling me that as couponers, we can get, this is they're $6.19. We got it for 31 cents. This is my favorite part about couponing. But, you know, that's besides the point. <laughs> So here's a scenario that I did for you guys. Um, this is actually like what I mentioned, what I need for my household. So I just want to give you guys some ideas of what you can possibly do. I know the Coke one is probably going to be something that not many of you guys want to do, or you guys don't drink Coke or soda in general. These other ones are pretty common. Um, I got a lot of people that needed detergent, um, shampoo or conditioner, which you can switch that out to conditioner. I think all of mine are shampoos. Um, just household items, these are always needed. That is what you guys commented that you guys wanted me to incorporate in these scenarios. I am more than happy to help you guys kind of pick and choose what's best for you. So please always feel free to comment. Make sure you subscribe to my channel if I am helping you because then you guys get notification when I post a new video. And then of course, always feel free and like please do give me some comments because I want to know that you guys are actually benefiting from this rather than like I'm just posting videos for no reason. <laughs> Thanks for watching guys. I will see you guys next time.